Alright guys, welcome back to JForce Gaming And let me ask you something, alright Have you always running out of space on your computer, your SD card, your phone Or even you, ha you have been um, trying to find that duplicate file that you always want to find But you cannot find it in the, in the sea of files inside your hard drive anywhere And it's impossible to find it Well we have a solution and it's with the help of this, this password duplicate file deleter alright so what this software basically does is that um, it finds all the kinds of duplicate files alright on your computer or your SD card your USB drive your phone anywhere as long as it's connected to your PC alright it's able to find all kinds of duplicate files like your images videos your music files your documents you know, um, basically any files that has that is being is similar or duplicated, alright, is able to find for you, and you can um, delete them, which are duplicate duplicated. You can delete them, and uh, you, know, you can clear, free up some space on your device and PC as well, because on your PC, on your phone, you know, it's easily to duplicate a lot of files of the same name or basically of the same files. So with this software, you can easily find out all these. Um, extra files that you actually don't need to clear some space on your phone and um, yeah it's very simple and straightforward I'm going to show you guys how you guys can do it in a while and all its features and function where you guys can uh, find your files so um, yeah alright so as you can see this one is the software itself the duplicate file deleter software so I'm going to add a folder and I've created actually a test folder which in this folder there is a lot of duplicated images, musics and a um, documents, PDF book document, you know, a lot of duplicate images, you know, so um, to see how it actually finds all these files. So um, you can add a folder, all right, you can either choose your hard disk, you can choose your hard disk, all right, it's so it's able to go through all the files on your disk, all right, or you can choose a specific folder. So I'm going to use a test folder. Alright, and this is my test folder. So you can scan for duplicate. This scan for duplicates basically is it, it can scan like other files like music files, documents. But for this one, it just scans for images which you can find similar images. So we are going to go with the scan similar images. Um, before you guys do that, alright, there's a lot of other ways you guys can uh, customize to what files you want to find. So you can choose the file size, alright, what kind of file size you want, alright, minimum, maximum. And you can, um, after you removing, you remove it to recycle bin or delete forever. You can choose within them, alright, and you can ignore the scan for like um, hidden files, zero byte files system files, excluded files, you wouldn't want to delete duplicate system files, right? Sometimes it might crash your system. So um, all this you will be ignored to scan. Right? And um, duplicate for the duplicate files, you guys can um, select what you guys want to scan. So you can by content, by the file name, right? So um, and what kind of files you want you to scan, document, image, audio. So if you want to scan all, like um, in my case, right, I'm going to select all. Okay, and uh, I don't have a specific preference for my file size, so I'm going to scan for similar images first. So once I click on scan, as you can see, it's very quick, it's fairly quick. Alright, it, this is very quick to scan. So you have found um, a few of the duplicate images and they actually group it for you. So um, which one is um, which one is the duplicate and... Um, <clears throat> so it's very well organized, so you can see like, oh maybe uh, I want to keep all this, uh, so I don't delete this, but this one I want to delete all. I don't want to have so many of these, so I can just select this and all will be selected. Maybe I want just want to keep one. Then I can just click on remove or I can like go on to my group tree and you know, this is all my uh, folders. Mm, I think I prefer I just want this one. So um as you can see. So and then I want to remove like um the rest of this. So I just, this one and keep this. Then the rest I'm gonna just click on remove and it will say so you remove so you remove some you remove one group of it already so this are all the group left as you can see so the rest will go into my recycle bin so yeah, as you can see so you can also see from the quantity itself how many are there or right, it will be arranged in quantity that's eight duplicate files eight similar images eight all right and if you guys want to see on, more, on a more detailed view or right, you can see uh, when is it uh, modified when is it uh, made all right what's the resolutions all those um, types of details it, you can all see all right if you want to delete guys all just click on delete all it will just leave it all you can just choose so it's very well organized for the uh, image one so you guys can um, choose which image you want to keep and want to delete all right so um, yeah this one can free up a lot of space and you can see how many 
how many space it took up so it took up 15.32 megabytes of the space for the all the duplicates so if i delete all the 14 it will save save you 23.4 megabytes all right so as for the scan duplicates all right i'm gonna choose the same folder as you remember the same folder all right i have doc a lot of documents as well so we're gonna scan for duplicates and after that see it's very it's very quick all right and as you can see um we have a lot of duplicates right here all right uh, this one is the um, pdf document we have a lot of duplicates here you can see all right and it's all arranged in how many um uh, how much storage it uses so this one uses this is the music folder and it's used up 78.66 megabytes so if i want to delete uh, especially this music click on this maybe i'll keep this all right this will all rest will be selected all right and then um and after that, I'll just click on remove and um, it will save 71.51 MB. Okay, uh, you have an image, you know, it's all categorized very well. So you can see there's documents. So these are all the documents that you have. Alright, so you can see just all the copy of the documents. Alright, everything is laid properly, also in a chron chronological order. So this one is the user most storage one, so it will be on the top. Alright. And yeah, it's audio because there's no video and there's no other files inside that, so it, it only detect all these four, which is correct. And basically, it will shows up on, it will group up for you. So audios go to audio, document go to document, and see which one you want to delete. And for the size, you can also see that the total, total file size is um ninety five point seven two megabytes. For the audio, how many size is used up? You can see. Right, and the great thing about this is like let's say if you want to delete this, uh, you see. They only select three out of four. Instead, you choosing all right. You only choose three because they don't want. They want to let you keep one extra unless if you choose to. Then if this, they will give you a warning. Say the last file. This is the last file. So once you remove, anything will be removed. All right. So yeah. So so you guys don't need to like select one by one. You can just click on this. All right, and then they just kept one for you. So in the end, the duplicates will be deleted, and then one will still remain. So, um, this one will can help you guys um save up a lot of space. And um, yeah, it also basically works on. Uh, you can, you know, um, search for um, files, pictures, everything in your SD card. You know, your USB drive, even your phone as well. As long as you connect your phone, uh, using the USB cable to the PC, or if you just plug in your USB, and search will come out. And then you can select the USB folder, and you will run through all the files that is duplicate, and it will let you know, and then see which one you want to delete. So. This is a very very helpful software that I recommend you guys if you guys are always running out of space on your phone, on your PC, or on your USB, or right? this can help you save a lot of time. Instead of from finding one by one, this can help you save a lot of time. And it is a very straightforward and uh, easy to navigate around the UI. So um you can, can also add more folders. You guys want to, you know, um the whole of the Alright, you're gonna you can choose you can scan the whole drive. Alright, my drive D is about a um one point eight one terabyte. So it will, it will take some time but you can scan all for you and then you can go ahead and select which one you want to delete. So uh, yeah, if you guys are interested you guys can uh, click the link in the the first link in the video description down below. Go ahead and check it out for yourself and get one for yourself. Alright, I would highly recommend you guys on getting this because this is really the best software you guys can to help you clear out space on your devices so um yeah so if you guys are interested once again go ahead and click the link in the video description down below and buy one for yourself so uh, yeah that's, that's all for today guys i uh, hope you guys uh, like today's video and if you find this helpful give it a thumbs up and if you guys um have any other suggestion of software you guys want me to review do let me know in the comment section down below as well so uh, that's it for today guys and i shall see you guys in my next video peace out I don't wanna cry